All right, Tahoe, we're back with the Lifestyles and Dining Show. Thanks for tuning in. We're sitting here with one of the owners of Mick Peas, Pete Joseph. Thanks for having us. You, you've been with a partner of ours for so long. It's, it's, it's a fresh breath of air every time we come in here to have a little fun, have a drink, some good food, located right here at the gondola. But this isn't where it started. No. It started a ways back, over 30 years ago, you said, in San Diego. Tell us some of the history and stories behind McPee's and how it started. Well, actually, McPee's, the original McPee's, still in existence 30 years ago, 1982. Started in Coronado, California, which is in San Diego. Mm -hmm. And uh, still going, the same thing, live music every night, no cover. You know, just a fun, casual place to come. Yeah. And uh, my partner and I decided we wanted to open another uh, place, so and we both like Lake Tahoe, so we just jumped on an airplane and came up here. And three months later, I you know, moved up here. That was 20 years ago now. All right. So and then uh, 10 years, we were across the street. Mm -hmm. And uh -huh. then uh, with all the redevelopment over there, um, we got kind of went through the eminent domain and yep. all that stuff with the city when they built the gondola. And we ended up over here. And uh, you know, another 10 years here now, 20 years. Yes, I, I like to say, when, you're, when you've been around that long, you've <laughs> got to have a great product to last that long. It's, you know, the, the industry's so cutthroat these days, well, so you've got to be doing some great things here. Well, it's challenging, you know, as a restaurant business and bar business is uh, a lot going on all mm -hmm. the time. You've got to keep things fresh and keep yeah. things new. And I mean, we still have live music every night, no cover charge, pool tables downstairs here, some fire pits outside. Yeah, those are real you know, nice. So. The, the fire directly on the table. Yeah. So it's nice and warm, and you're looking right over at the gondola up at Heavenly, and you can see right. it going up. So. Great view from uh, from uh, the tree house here. We got yeah. the trees growing up through the, yeah, the deck the outdoor here. Outdoor deck with the heating the yeah, heating elements so. out here, and you can see inside to the where the live music is right, right over our shoulders. And, but the real story here, St. Patty's Day. You guys are an Irish pub, so that's like the the big shebang. That's our over day the course for of the sure. Year. Yep. Uh, you you mentioned you've got some uh, some ambassadors coming in from we do we Guinness have the, the Guinness and Bud Light. Uh, Guinness girls, the Budweiser girls will be giving away a bunch of swag and yep. you know stuff like that and whatever it is they give away. It always livens up the party a oh, little yeah. bit. Oh yeah. And uh, Felix and the Soul Cats will be here at nine o'clock. Great okay. band, good okay. dance band. We're gonna have a lot of fun. And good, that's sort of a tradition. They've been doing it for a while. They so have. you've got the locals that have been doing it year after year and coming here, and then you got a good mix of visitors that are walking right over from the That's Marriott right. and the Grand Residence. That's so. right, and we have people that come back here year after year after year from, from all over the world, you know, like wow. England, UK, yeah. a lot of people are from. Um, we get them back year after year, so um, awesome. that's good. You know, it's a good thing. We like what, that. What's your go-to meal when when you come <laughs> in here? And do you have one go-to, or do you like everything on the menu and you like to split it up? I like a few of the items more than you know some of the others, but I really, really, really like the shepherd's pie, especially in the winter time when it's cold. Mm -hmm. Really good, hearty, home-style food, it's comfort food. Here. Yeah. It's really big. Wow. The ribs are good. You wouldn't think that the Irish pub would have the, the great ribs, but they're really, really tasty. And of course the burgers, the sandwiches, the nachos are massive and they're really, really good. I think we, uh, we just had those in the last yeah. segment and we so. were carrying them away and I think I got tendonitis <laughs> in my wrist just carrying those nachos away. Definitely shareable. Yeah. Those are those are shareable yeah. for sure. Yeah, so, good stuff. Those are good. Well, we appreciate you having us. Um, anything you want to, what, how, how can people get more information, make a reservation? We don't actually take reservations. I um, like it. It's Keeping kind of it first real. come, first yeah. serve. Um, very casual here. You got the, the upstairs is a kind of a different vibe than the downstairs. Two bars, big screen TVs. I think yeah. you guys might have covered all that already with yeah. the uh, NFL ticket it's a great and spot you know, to be. The MLB extra innings, all that stuff. So a little bit of something going on all the time. Kids are certainly welcome. Yep. Family friendly, and you know, in the summertime we got the outdoor patio where we're dog friendly as well. Not so. to mention, we forgot to mention the pool table. We got a pool, pool table down do. here, right next to the bar. We so. do. Happy hour. No shortage you know, of uh, fun up. here. Right. All righty. Well, thanks for having us. Thanks very Keep much. up the good work and uh, everything you're doing here in the community. Thanks mm -hmm. very much. All right. That's going to wrap up the McT McPee's Dining Show. We'll see you next time.